out, he said, no. Yeah, I, I don't want to go. I told you, I already have plans to go to Warp Tour this summer with Stephanie. Oh, come on. Bible camp is so lame. They don't even let me listen to My Chemical Romance there. <laughs> Whatever, Dad. Can you just leave me alone? I got a friend over. All right. Whatever. Oh, my God. Sorry about that. You know parents. They could be so lame. <laughs> They'll never know how hard it is for teenagers like us. But, hey, I appreciate you coming down to my place and, you know, supporting my small business. <laughs> um, I'm Damien. But you can call me XX underscore Fallen Angel 666 underscore XX. <laughs> you may have seen me on MySpace. <laughs> no? How about Tumblr? <laughs> Hold on. Let me do this real quick. Yeah, you remember that one? <laughs> yeah, I went viral for that selfie, but it's no biggie. Anyways, um, you wanted to get a haircut, right? Oh, sorry. I have to take this. I'm sorry. Oh, it's the brand new Flip Sidekick 24. I just got it for Christmas. My lame dad got me one that's silver. I told him I wanted the all-black model, but like I said, parents will never get it. Just Stephanie I'm trying to get her tickets to Warp Tour. Send. All right. Now where were we? Haircut, right? Sick. Yeah, you know, I started cutting hair in my room so I can raise money for this guitar. It's signed by Gerard Way. Do you know who he is? Yeah. My Chemical Romance is my jam. I'll put this around your neck real quick. Give me a sec. Okay. That way we don't get any uh, hair on your pierced veil hoodie. <laughs> yeah, do you know about My Chemical Romance? They're like super cool. You're not a poser, are you? <sighs> Good. Welcome to the Black Parade is my favorite song. What's yours? I don't think I know that one. But Welcome to the Black Parade is a really good song. What's your favorite album? Hmm. Huh. I don't think I know that album. But Welcome to the Black Parade is a really good album. <laughs> Here. Close your eyes. I'm just going to spray down your hair a little bit. <laughs> what? Sorry, sometimes my dad will just open the door, which is why I'm trying to lock it. But he always gets mad when I do. Parents, right? <laughs> so weird. So. What kind of look are we going for today? Um, I mean, I can do anything you want. I can make you look like this. Mm-hmm. I can make you look like that. Yeah, that's a popular one. And I can even do this. If you're into it. I got a couple friends that I did that to last week. They seem to really like it. Okay. Keeping it classic with one of these. Totally fine. That's gonna look really good while you're skateboarding. <laughs> you don't skateboard. You draw or something? You play an instrument? Maybe you should find yourself a talent. I'm a singer. Yeah, I'm in this band right now. We haven't really got a gig yet, and it's just me, but I'm pretty sure we're going to go pretty far. So, uh, just make sure all my supplies are in tip-top shape. I'm going to make you look like an emo god. Perfect. Now, go ahead and sit still. 
Uh, no, I don't really have any plans for after school. My parents want me to go to college. But you know, that's just the way the system keeps you down. <laughs> Fight the system. Yeah, you know, I was thinking I want to be more of like an artist. Music, painting, poems, which I know this really, really good bar that I go to with my friends. Don't worry, the owner's chill. Lots of sin for free. Don't need IDs or anything. And they have slam poetry night there. Everyone loves my poems. I mean, yeah. If you want, I can spit something off the top of the cranium. Fine. Let me drop some wisdom on you. Slam poetry is really just speaking from the heart. Without even using your brain, just straight emotions. I'll give you an example. Stop lights. Stop light? In the darkness, my brain is in there forever while my heart is wrapped around in a knit sweater? Stop light. More like stop fight. Can I sleep at night with all my might? I see a sandwich and I bite. Stop light. Just a little something I've been working on. I know. Pretty powerful stuff. But, uh, my parents don't really believe in me. Actually thought it was pretty good. <laughs> stop it. Stop. No, you. You stop. Seriously. Stop it. <laughs> You're a funny one. I like you. So what kind of music do you listen to other than my chemical romance? <sighs> that looks good. Okay, pierce the veil. Pretty obvious. Bring me the horizon. Very cool. How about Fall Out Boy? Oh yeah. Fall Out Boy is one of my favorites. <laughs> I don't know if you've heard their one song, Dance, Dance, Dance. It's really, really good. No, I haven't heard of that song. But have you heard Dance, Dance, Dance? It's a great song. It's a classic. Only true fans know. I'm just gonna brush through your hair a little bit. But yeah, I'm always trying to find a lot of underground bands out there. Like there's this really cool underground band right now. Their name is um, Slipknot. And there's like a lot of different members. It's really cool. There's like nine of them. Uh, yeah, their music's a little hardcore. It's like brutal heavy metal, you know? Not many newbies to metal can handle it, but I can. Oh, yeah, for sure. I can definitely give you some music recommendations. Like their album, All Hope Is Gone. Really cool album. And their song, All Hope Is Gone. It's one of my favorites on the album. Um, other songs on the album. Well, there's All Hope Is Gone. And like... Like 12 more. So, yeah, we'll definitely check it out sometime. I uh, got a CD of it somewhere in my closet. Could definitely grab it for you. It's looking real good. Uh, you're not missing much. Kind of a complete package, really. Alright. So, um,. How's school going? Making any friends? I know. It's so hard for weirdos like us to make friends. Oh, sorry. I just got 40 new followers on my MySpace page. It's so annoying trying to keep up with these people. No, I 
don't want to be your friend. It's this dumb jock on the football team thinks I'm going to be his friend. Just because he knows I'm doing his homework for him makes it think that we can just hang out. <laughs> no way. I'm not going to be seen with the jocks. It's so annoying. Sometimes I just gotta let him know that I'm way too cool to be seen around him. Oh yeah, like when I'm by the water fountain at school and I'm being alone, just leave me alone. Now, I'm gonna go through with this comb here. And we're just going to kind of thin out your hair a little bit. Okay, I'm just gonna bring a little bit more volume to the back. If you're gonna want to tease your hair, you're gonna want some volume. Trust me, it's what's in. Okay, good, good. So, what, uh, what? Dad. Sorry, such a weirdo. I was checking in. It's so annoying having a caring parent, right? It's like, I never got asked to be born in this pathetic world. It's so frustrating whenever I'm just trying to cry and my dad checks up on me like, what's wrong? Society, dad. <sighs> Society. Oh, and then the worst part is, is while I'm crying and he's trying to hug me, he's like, I'm just trying to be a good parent. More like trying to be a good poo-poo head. <laughs> Such a derp face. Okay. That looks pretty good. I'll just give you some more combing up here. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Now, are you looking to dye your hair today? Or do you want to do that next time? Next time? Yeah, for sure. Can't help but notice you had just a little bit of stubble. Can take care of that. Mm -hmm. I just added on to what you're already paying for, so you're fine. You are paying me, right? The large monster tall can. Good, good. The original flavor. Nice. And did you have the sour gummy worms too? Perfect. Okay. Well, here, just to kind of prep your face with some solution that I have. Open up your pores, make sure the shaving goes really well. It's black like my soul. <laughs> here, let me grab this. And I'm just gonna spray just a little bit of my solution on there. Oh, it's perfectly safe. I don't test on animals. What do I test on? Humans. I mean, what are you, right? Close your eyes. There you go. Good. Nice. How's that feel? It burns? Okay, good. Yeah, it's supposed to burn. Okay. Got myself some shaving cream. And we're just gonna put some on your face, okay? Okay, good. Alright, I'm just going to rub some of that solution on there for you. Awesome. You can be the coolest looking kid. Did you hear the new talent show is uh, going to be coming up this year? Yeah, I was thinking about auditioning, showing off the pipes, but I just think people are going to make fun of me. 
What do you mean? Yeah, of course. People always make fun of me. The way I dress, the way I look, the fact that I put makeup on. I mean, it's kind of brutal at school. Not many people tend to give me a chance. They just see me and think they know who I am, you know? Yeah, I know who I am. I'm a pretty cool person. said hi either. I always wondered why. I would not have made fun of you. Why would you think that? <laughs> Look at, you're here now. You're helping me out and my business. Which I really appreciate that. Of course we're friends. <laughs> we'll be blasting all the My Chemical Romance on our way to Warp Tour this summer. You want to come? Yeah, I'm just taking, you know, myself. Self, so yeah, I mean, plenty of room in my car. It's a 1999 Toyota, pretty cool. Busted the wheel about a week ago, hopped up on the curb on accident trying to park. Yeah, it's my dad's car, but he lets me borrow it whenever I want to do stuff with it. Always gets mad because I bring it back with no gas and at least a new scratch, but that's part of the fun, right? <laughs> Here. We'll just say that we're friends. Go to Warp Tour. See how it goes. And hey, maybe we can uh, check out more shows. I know this really cool coffee shop down the road, too. It's called Rad Coffee. It's pretty rad there. I'll definitely check them out. <laughs> this is kind of nice. I usually do this part alone. No, not shaving faces, um, making plans. It's kind of nice to hear someone say that sounds fun, other than all my stuffed animals. <laughs> yeah, I got a Chauncey the bear. It's a older bear I had since I was a kid. My dad got him for me. Favorite toy ever since. Yeah, I cleaned you up really well. Let me wipe it off. This is honestly really fun. Talking to a friend. Doing my favorite thing, which is cutting hair, styling. Other than singing and listening to My Chemical Romance, of course. Here. Still got a couple more steps to go, but I want you to have this. Ever see yourself having a bad hair day or need a quick touch up? <gasps> it unfolds and gives you the best of both worlds. You got a nice fine tooth comb. And then over here, you have more of a like a detangler brush. It's super useful. and it'll get you out of any pickle anytime you need it. Here, I'll put it right there. Now, final thing is we gotta make sure you look good. Of course your hair looks amazing, but we need to make sure your eyes look like a bleeding raccoon. Fine, no blood, just a raccoon. 
this is just a classic gel liner. Here, just hold still. Look up like that. There you go. Sick. You're gonna go home and your parents are gonna be like, what? And you're gonna be like, society. It's gonna be awesome. Good, good. Just hold still. I'm gonna get the top. I'm gonna smudge it a little bit. Really give you that crunchy look. It doesn't matter if you're not doing anything after this. Just show yourself. Look at yourself in the mirror. See if you like the look. Before I go to Warp Tour, I can do it for you. Yeah, there's a mirror right there. What do you think? <laughs> you like it? Good, good. Now, I've got a little gift for you. I started making my own face masks recently. You know, using natural ingredients. And this is a little sample I have. It's like a honey lemon scrub. Just put it under your eyes, put it on your cheeks. Anywhere on your face. And I promise you, that part of your face is going to be as smooth as ever. No breakouts, no irritation, a lot less oil production because I got really oily skin. This is for you. <laughs> you can pay me back another time. That's just a gift. I sell full bottles too over on my MySpace. Hmm. I don't know if opening up an online shop is pretty viable. I mean, who really wants to go on the internet to buy things? Yeah, it's not really that popular right now. I'd much rather go on there just to watch cat videos. <laughs> Merp. <laughs> God. So, everything's looking pretty good. You just need to make sure you smell like a true emo. Here. This is a brand new emo cologne I've been working on. It's this really cool scent. Check it out. <sighs> Pretty nice, right? That's fog juice. Mm -hmm. Mixed with a little bit of concert sweat. Monster energy, of course. Yep. Metal studs. I let them rust inside there. It's really cool. You can have it. It's no biggie whatsoever. Just make sure to clean your skin afterwards. I noticed I got really irritated. Yeah. But, hey. You look great. Um, oh, Monster and gummy worms. Thank you so much. I really needed this. My dad doesn't let me drink Monster anymore, but I manage. He's more of a Red Bull kind of guy, but I just told him, monster, you know? It's like, monster. <laughs> Sorry. I just never really had anyone stay this long before. Um, I'll let you go, though. Maybe we can hang out again another time. I'll be sure to, you know, write some more slam poetry and I can tell you more. You can, you know, just hit me up on MySpace, or I'll see you around art class. Of course. X no, 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 you don't need to call me my username. Um, Damien. Yeah, for sure. It's nice to meet you. I'll see you around. <laughs> okay. Good job, Damien. <laughs> You didn't forget to smile.